Love the stray with the reading for the collective. Take what resonates throughout the rest. So some parts could feel like your reading. You intuitively know, or it's confirming something that you already know. Um, and other parts might not be a match. Um, that could be happening throughout the reading. Um, or the, the whole entire reading. This It's for someone else, or it's all for you. Um, it's mostly just confirmation. Um, whoa. Three of Swords Reverse fell out. King of Pentacles Reverse. Three of Swords Reverse. King of Pentacles Reverse. Ace of Pentacles Reverse. I don't know if this is someone who didn't want you to... You know, someone that wanted you to take a loss. Someone that's real corrupt. Or stole something from you. I don't know if this is an attorney... Or an ex or business colleague, a co-worker, you're too strong for something. This person, they did something foolish and it's like they're falling on their head. This bullying is over. Someone was bullying you. And now they're weighed down. Or this could be you, you feel like you've got a lot, um, I don't know, you've got a lot on your plate. So, this person could need money now. Um, seven of Pentacles. They've got to take a step back and rework what they've done here. Ace of Pentacles reverse again. This could be you recovering from something, but the reading came out so fast. I was going to say when I first started, besides that, I appreciate all of your positive energy. Um, I was going to say that I feel like someone could be crying or someone that there's, I feel like there's self-hatred and somebody's crying. And I feel like I'm hearing a seagull, so there could be something about the beach, shells, ocean, um, lighthouse, seven of pentacles. Somebody is taking a loss. They took something from you, though. In the subconscious, we have Saturn in Taurus, Saturn in Libra, Six of Wands reverse. There's something about feels like someone was fighting you or struggling with you. You know, trying to push you out of the way and be in the limelight. This is some sort of greedy person, um, corrupt person. Um, I don't know if this is an attorney or like a corrupt attorney. Knight of Pentacles reverse. Someone real irresponsible. Someone that was trying to slow something down for you. I feel like they wanted you out of the limelight. They wanted to be the center of attention. They could have stolen something from you. Six of Wands reversed. Deep down, they're feeling like Jupiter in Leo. They're being seen as the anti-hero. They will be seen as the anti-hero. Um, or the antagonist, the bad guy. You're going to fall from grace. The bad guy, the bad gal. The bad person. Um, 
Seven of Cups. They've been trying to figure everything out. This person isn't really sure how, what move to make. A magician. So I feel like, yeah, they have to let something go. The Wheel of Fortune and the Upright. I feel like this Wheel of Fortune is something that's aligned, that's faded. It's also good karma. It's something, you know, you co-creating with the universe. Um, a series a series of choices that lead to this point. Um, and that you've made. You could be manifesting something here. You, you, you're very confident. Or this could be somebody else. This is somebody who wanted you to take a loss. This is somebody that is very corrupt. <sighs> Greedy. Four of Pentacles. They're concerned with power. Money. Holding on. They could have been holding on to something of yours. But also what could be going on is they were holding on to something of yours, but you're manifesting something anyway. You've overcome some type of grief. Someone could have purposely tried to hold on to something so that it would hurt you. But the problem is, is that the universe is conspiring to, with you, to bring something into form that's, it's like it's already there. It's already shaped. Maybe from your, you know, your desire, your vision. It's like, it's, it's beaming out of you. Um, I feel like this person is afraid or they've done something, um, or they feel like you're hiding something, but they feel like you're going to manifest something, or there's someone here. Page of Swords Reverse. The moon. Not good energy. Somebody, this feels like a mental imbalance. Someone, someone's feeling, I mean, I have to let something go. This is like stalkery energy. Uh, slander, stalking, but doing things hidden, hiding it, hiding what they were doing. A king of pentacles reverse, who feels mentally off balance, trying to destroy you, take something from you, break your heart, doing it in a hidden way. There's stalking going on here. Um, but they feel like they can't see something that you're doing. They're expecting for you to either there's someone working on your behalf or this is you. But they just can't see see what it is. They could feel afraid. I feel like this person could be with that moon and page of swords reverse trying to hide something that they're doing now. Um, or if they're trying to hide it, they slandered you. Something. Page of cups reverse in the near future. I feel like they, they want to know what you're doing. They want to know what you're doing. Someone could be projecting they want you to hate yourself. Or this person hates themselves and you could be picking up on it. Especially if they're very ultra focused on you. I feel like someone's crying. Um, or they want you to feel like you're taking some sort of loss. I feel like there's heavy projection here. Um, I don't know if this person's doing it on purpose or not, but I feel like they're very focused on you. It's a masculine energy. Or there's a masculine energy involved, heavily involved. Um, page of Cups re reverse in the near future. 
somebody could be telling sweet little lies in the near future or somebody could be crying they could be in their feelings because they did something very foolish they're falling on their head the universe is not catching them they took a leap and now it, they feel silly or they look foolish um you're too balanced, you're too patient, you're, they can't, I feel like this is also you transmuting energy as well. Take, this is the middle path, you're taking the middle path. There could be a Sagittarius involved. Yeah, there's definitely something, Page of Swords Reverse, either the way you've handled the slander or the stalking, they can't knock you off your square six of pentacles reverse i don't know if this is somebody who wants something from you who already tried to take something or they, they abuse their power or they, they want you to beg but now they're begging something about you what you're building to create this ten of pentacles with a group of people this could be, you could be a business owner you could have a lot on your plate. I feel like this could be you doing a lot on your own. And it's, you know, you're at this sort of, you're, you were at this place or you are at this place. You're, you're moving very quickly towards some sort of situation where this project or this job or this career or this, entrepreneurial endeavor whatever it is you're getting to a place where you're going to need to hire people or something like that or you're going to take it take it to another team it's about to be done or something like that um i just feel like this person wants to know what you're doing they're they're projecting um or you're already working with people on something um, or you're manifesting that. Queen of Cups Reverse is a lens someone's looking through. So, yeah, a King of Pentacles Reverse is either looking at this Queen of Cups Reverse who isn't looking at them. So this King of Pentacles Reverse could be judging this Queen of Cups Reverse. If it's this Queen of Cups Reverse, if it's their reading, they could be focused on you so much that they're not concerned about this King of Pentacles reverse because they, they're the ones that are stalking, slandering, and want to know what you're doing. I mean, this could be a couple. They don't have to be. Uh, Queen of Cups reverse. This, this is someone who's very manipulative. They could be very moody. Their feelings are all over the place. Maybe they want to know what you're doing because... <laughs> King of Pentacles reverse, Devil reverse. Someone's obsessed with you. This King of Pentacles reverse is obsessed with you. Or these two people are obsessed with you. This person could be in their feelings, moody, fickle, manipulative, draining. Uh, not, can you know, this is someone who plays games emotional games, emotional blackmail, everything is dependent on what you could do for them. Um, emotionally manipulative, materialistic, judgmental, superficial. These two are focused on you, they're obsessed. Six of Pentacles reversed. These, these people didn't get something or the, at some point they had the capacity to take something from you they took they took the opportunity they didn't hold back with the fool they 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 took a leap of faith but it was it was reckless they did something reckless and now it's not working out in their favor. I feel like they want to know what you're doing. Maybe so that they can try to wreck it. But they're obsessed with you. 
Maybe they want to know what you're doing or who you're working with so that they can slander you. These people could be um, broke. Or they try to, I feel like these people try to take something from you. I feel like if this King of Pentacles reverse is looking at this Queen of Cups reverse, they have some sort of disdain for this person. I feel like these two have their backs turned to one another. I feel like they're both angry and projecting at you. Um, but they're a team. They're a team in the sense that they both need something or want something from you. Or it's like, I feel like they're just dis disappointed in one another because they didn't get what they thought they were going to get in this team, this alliance they made. Somebody here is very evil minded. They could be bigoted. They've done something very underhanded. They could be trying to do something underhanded. A group of people, a lot of conflict. Um, but they have, there's something about having to let it go, but I feel like the intensity of the projection, Ten of Swords, they really want to see you down or, or they feel they could be projecting this Ten of Swords or some sort of painful ending happening with them. They're projecting it at you. The truth could be coming out or they hate your clarity or this breakthrough. You're having a breakthrough. This could have to do with communication. This could have to do with some type of, um, decision in love or contract you can tr maybe you're contracting with someone but they can't see what you're doing I feel like these people feel frustrated how can they block you if they don't know where which way you're going um how can they steal from you how i feel like they need something wow page of swords reverse in the environment so these are like people in the environment, stalkers, slanderers, Ace of Cups reverse. They feel empty inside. Um, people could be talking about them. They could be sending messages to people or back and forth. This could be happening online. They could be stalking you online. They could be going through a tower or there could be people realizing what these people did. And it's a tower for them because they're exposed or people are shocked. These people could be losing everything. Somebody who um, is real bitter, malicious, using words to cut you down. I feel like not just you, I feel like this person cuts people down in general. Um, Also, Queen of Swords Reverse. Wow, death. They're seriously trying to end something for you. I feel like they're frustrated. They don't want you to have this sense of love and abundance for yourself. Ace of Pentacles Reverse. They want to take this blessing from you. They tried already. The moon, but they're... They could be trying to do it in a hidden way, or they could be doing something that's timed with a moon cycle. Hey Siri, when is the next full moon? Hey Siri, when is the next full moon? February 24th. February 24th. Okay, so February 24th. This could be happening on f February 24th. On around February 24th. So I feel like that's three days from now, depending on when you're watching this reading. To try to slow something down. That is if this does if that is what this is about. Having to do with your ten of cups. February 24th, so that's like three days from now. That would be around the weekend. Some sort of communication. Something's moving quickly, but I feel like people are watching something, maybe online, um, or reading a message. Someone could be falling in love with you as well, or you're falling in love. 
someone is leaving a situation or if you've healed from something there's definitely something about you healing and moving on and someone just doesn't know what you're doing and I feel like they feel like they need something from you they already tried to take something they're trying to do something hidden they're getting exposed I feel like they're near you um, or very close to you um, maybe online they want to know how, how much money you have or what you're building whether you feel like you're getting this Ten of Pentacles or you have this Ten of Pentacles. Someone's walking away with this Ten of Pentacles. They already tried to take something from you. This could be something that is born of your spirit. It's your, your spark. Your creation. Your passion. Your idea. Um, Two of Cups reverse hopes and fears, so they don't want you to come together with somebody. Um, they feel frustrated when they can't see you. Outcome Four of Pentacles reverse, they're gonna have to let something go. These people, they did something really mean and petty, maybe at work or in regards to your work or your job or your career or project. They could try to stop you from working. They could be trying to stop you from working now. These people are near you. I don't know if this is you at work. This could be happening at the workplace or this has to do with your work. Um, but I, and I think they have something of yours. There's someone here that's disingenuous. They have something of yours. Someone that maybe you thought was your friend. I don't know if these are your friends. So with someone that was your friend, or or this is just how these people roll. They love bomb people, that's how they get ahead, but they feel like they failed at something. They try to steal something of yours. Eight of Pentacles reverse under the deck. Someone could be losing their job, or they wanted you to lose your job. They're, they could be doing something really petty now. Um, so I feel like this is a cycle that they've already, their experience, I feel like karma is playing out. Part of it is like they're exposed and they can't even see. They're so obsessed with something here. They can't see that, or they don't care that they're getting exposed because they're so, I don't know, there could be some sort of lunacy here. And it could involve the moon cycle. It's definitely about trying to block a partnership. Um, people operating in the background. They could be trying to, there could be someone here trying to keep a couple together because they, they, they get something out of it. Or they want to keep you apart from someone, maybe from forming an alliance, some type of business partnership or love relationship. Four of Pentacles reversed. They're gonna have to let something go. These people are power hungry. I feel like they could have taken something from you. Now they feel like they need something more. It wasn't enough, or they, they, they're taking a loss. They wanted you to take a loss. Maybe you did take a loss. They stole something from you. And now they wanna know what you're doing now. They need more. They need more there. These are greedy people. They tried to take something from you for power. Um. They might have succeeded, but I feel like they have to get it back or let it go. Or it's like, what are you manifesting? Because you've overcome, it hurt you. They feel like you're reworking something, but they can't see what you're doing. Or that's their fear. They feel like you're just going to emerge with something here you know, something maybe even life-changing, something very significant. They could have done something very petty to take something from you. Um, advice from a friend.
someone is trying to talk someone through something, someone feels like they're in a labyrinth, they're trying to, or someone trying to trap you in a situation where it was like a labyrinth. They tried to steal something from you and trap you in a situation that was like a labyrinth so you wouldn't know the exit. You wouldn't be able to find the exit. You'd be lost, lost in a labyrinth. Like at the end of the movie, The Shining. This could be dealing with a man. This could be a man that did this. So it could be this King of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, I feel like this King of Pentacles reverse, they're upset with this Queen of Cups reverse. Or they or they know what they're dealing with. And they don't care because they're a King of Pentacles reverse. Advice from a friend. They could be getting advice from a Queen of Cups reverse. Or this Queen of Cups reverse is seeking advice from this King of Pentacles reverse. Or they're worried about you getting help from someone, this magician. Advice from a friend. Romance is in the air. Someone will gossip about all of your secrets. This could have been something that happened in December, or this could relate to something that happened in December. Some sort of situation that was temporary, a temporary situation in December. Someone's getting, trying to get advice. There's gossip here. Page of Swords reversed. This is gossip and slander. Gossip, slander, there's romance involved. Somebody could be getting advice from a friend. Romance is in the air. Someone is overcoming some sort of heartbreak. Someone's talking about someone. Someone's getting advice. Maybe they're get, trying to get romantic advice. Someone is talking about someone. Dog. A distant friend is thinking of you. There's something about... So we have dog twice. Something about friendship, loyalty, someone thinking about you. Romance in the air. Someone's trying to get advice. Someone is thinking about you. Someone is gossiping about all of your secrets. Dark woman. Dealing with a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. Someone here is real greedy. A king of pentacles reverse would be very greedy. Danger. Especially in money matters. Okay, you're dealing with a King of Pentacles reverse, who's very greedy, very, very greedy. And s they could be the ones getting advice. There's something about your success. This distant friend is thinking about you. There's something about your money and wealth. They could try to take something from you. Temptational. I don't know if someone wants to tempt you. Because we saw that Knight of Cups reverse. Someone's very disingenuous. There could be a whole family involved. With that moon card. That moon. Someone's trying to hide something. I don't know if someone wants to travel towards you. Or you're thinking about traveling somewhere. 
situation that requires car careful handling. So when they're, they need advice, this is that they've got to be very careful about something. They're very greedy. There's definitely greed here. King of Pentacles reverse, Four of Pentacles reverse. Someone, a distant friend is thinking of you. Someone that you, and your good fortune. Someone that you know. Romance is in the air. Someone could, they want to block this romance and they feel like you're going to get this fortune or you have this fortune or someone wants to. They've got to be careful. So there's a lot of hard work ahead. You, you could be working hard. Beware of greed. Someone is very greedy around you. Someone is very greedy around you. Focused on your bag. Very great. Yeah, I feel like they've got some sort of content towards this Queen of Cups reverse. It's like they didn't get something out of this person, or they feel like they're unreliable. Or this Queen of Cups reverse has contempt for. They, this Queen of Cups reverse could be trying to get advice on this King of Pentacles reverse who they feel like is coming towards you. I'm not sure yet. But they're stalk they're stalking. Someone is or these people are seen as stalkers or slanderers. Situations that require careful handling. They've got to be careful. Beware of greed. Or you've got to be careful, be aware of greed. I feel like you are careful. Too much concern with sexual matters. There's something about someone who cares about who you're... This could be a masculine energy with dark skin or hair. Something to do with romance. They either want to know who you're connecting with or this person wants to come towards you, or there's a Queen of Cups worried about this person coming towards you. It's about what you have and what you're building, what you're making. And I feel like these people already took something from you and they want to take something else. And there's someone here maybe who wants to love bomb someone. Someone here could uh, be having legal troubles or they could have tried to get you involved with something. Um, Or they could have, there could be a, an attorney here, a corrupt attorney. <sighs> Situations that require careful handling. Six of Wands reverse. Someone's worried about um, announcements. Someone's going to make an announcement. It's going to make them look bad. feel like that's what's coming. They feel like it's going to make them feel sad. It's going to send them into depression. This announcement. Someone can be worried that you're about to connect with someone. They want to know what you're, you're doing, your money, or someone wants, someone's getting advice though as well. Seven of Cups in the recent past. Someone's been trying to figure out their options. Reconciliation and great happiness. This could be someone from your past that wants to come towards you. Or there's someone here. Yeah. Let some things off about it. You're protected from harm. You 
have strong protection, strong intuition. You're protected from this person. You could be someone with dark hair or skin. Or this could be an ancestor of yours protecting you. Problems to be resolved. These problems are being resolved. I don't know if someone wanted to come towards you to re resolve a problem, but it's like they can't. They can't. Because, and someone is, they want to know who this new person is in your life. Or they feel like someone, there's someone new. Magician. Someone feels like. Could be something regarding November. November could be significant. They feel dissat. They still dissatisfied. They feel like they're going to be dissatisfied. You're you're going to manifest something, or you're dealing with this magician. Someone who's really good at making things happen. Someone very confident, or this is you. Time to go out and have some fun. Yeah, someone feels like you're gonna be on this adventure, really manifesting. Um, if it's like a date or a it's definitely something about him. Masculine energy with dark hair or skin. Feeling dissatisfied or or someone's feeling like this masculine energy is coming towards you, that they're a magician. There's something about October or November here that is very important. They feel like they're going to have to increase their efforts here. Somebody here is real upset or someone is making up lies or pay attention to your work. Someone could be paying attention to your work or this could be happening at work. Someone's sweet talking someone or someone's very emotional at work. It has to do with you being victorious over some endeavor or they're em emotional over your work. A sincere wish being granted for you. They could be... Or someone is sweet-talking someone at work. The thing is, is that you're protected from negative forces that are beyond your control. Someone's looking at this Queen of Cups reverse, I feel like, with content. A younger woman dealing with a relationship with a younger woman. So this could be someone that's younger than whoever this person is, or this person's younger than you, this Queen of Cups reverse. Because they're looking at you, new paths opening up for you. Yeah, it seems someone is very concerned about what you have coming. People here, Page of Swords Reverse. What are these people? What's going on here? August could be significant about the stalker slander energy that take care enemies are working against you. So yeah, these people are like enemies. They're enemies, they're stalkers, they're slanderers in the environment. I don't know if these are, I feel like these people are in your energy. They're thinking about what you have go going on. For someone, this could be you at work, people in close proximity. Um, you could feel like in your neighborhood or in your, where you live, around where you live. You could feel the sense of, uh, you know, like distracting energy, you know, at work or near where your home is. Someone purposely trying to 
see what you're doing or there's some sort of stalker energy or slander around you working against you because they want to see they feel like you're this wish is being granted they want to see what you're getting um but they're i feel like they don't have all the answers and someone is trying to get advice about you Someone could be very upset. This is that crying energy at work. Someone's crying at work. Or they're having a, a tough time at work. Hard work ahead. I feel like someone still feels like, you know, a wish could be granted for you and it's connected to some sort of love relationship. Yeah, romance. And that they're gonna have to work harder. Uh, it's your career and romance. They're gonna have to work harder at something. It's definitely something about December. This all just feels like the months that keep coming out, November, December, August, it's all, you know, fall into winter. Yeah, September. September. This all has to do with this winter and you enjoying yourself or, yeah, building a solid foundation and enjoying yourself this winter. It could be something to do with you traveling, something happening while you're traveling or while someone was traveling, something that someone, it can never go back. someone did something while they were traveling, it could never go back. News of a birth or business opportunity connected to some sort of traveling. And this could be what someone's trying to resolve. There's success in your energy. Something is going to work out something is working out with the star energy you could have star energy you have star energy and someone just feels very unclear about you um they're gonna have to let something go for pentacles reverse recognition reward for merit So yeah, I feel like somebody has been trying to block you from being seen. They tried to take something from you and hold you back, it feels like, by stealing from you, stalking you, slandering. They can't see what you're doing. They feel like someone's coming towards you. You've got this abundance. They're worried something is working out for you. It's going to work out no matter what. They feel like you're gonna appear out of thin air as this master manifester having created something or aligning yourself with someone um, and you're going to be creating this Ten of Pentacles. Um, it's going to make them feel dissatisfied with life. Club. Someone will try to make you do something against your will. So I just feel like there's someone here that wants to intervene. Someone wants to intervene. Someone wants to... I don't know, manipulate your energy. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. So if you feel like you've got a frenemy around you, I definitely wouldn't tell them. Yeah, you know, someone here is very concerned with money. They're very materialistic. This could be someone who chooses inappropriate surrogate families. Just, you know, to benefit themselves. And there's something about you moving on, moving forward, away from a situation. You're starting something new. Or you already did this. Um, this is someone who's tried to destroy you. Someone who's very, very greedy, tried to destroy you by taking something from you. 
and keeping it for themselves. Like a double whammy. They just felt like they were leaving you in a maze. With nothing. Yeah, they tried to block all of your connections. They tried to ruin all of your connections, leave you in a maze so you wouldn't know who you could or couldn't talk to. Yeah, this was definitely about destroying all of your your relationships. So you wouldn't have any money, you wouldn't know who to trust, you would have lost your assets, you would have lost your business, you would have lost an important intellectual property, you would have lost a creative project, um, you wouldn't know who to ask for for help because they would have slandered you. You wouldn't know why. This is all behind your back. Yeah, no companionship. Also, no love. No one to hold your hand. No one to talk to. No one to get your feelings out. Yeah, this all has to do with gossip. Someone talking horribly about you. Taking something from you and then talking about you horribly. But they did this to a child divine. You're someone that's very innocent and loving. You have a special connection with the divine. And you might also help people a lot. You don't, I don't think you make a big show out of it though. So while they were trying to block all your networks, you were doing something here connected with the, the divine the divine might have been the one that intervened in this. So they could be wondering how this all happened without any help from anyone. These people don't want to face their own demons. Or they're just run by this real dark... Their, their dark energy, they're too... They're in their head a lot. Someone's in their head a lot. Why couldn't they destroy you? I don't know if someone wants to come to you with some sort of romantic offer. They definitely see you as this goddess energy or they feel like someone else does. You emanate the regal feminine. Um, yeah, there's a Don Juan here. Who's very greedy. Trying to get advice from a friend on the right words to say. This is not a hero. I don't know. This person could have. tried to ruin your connections, your relationships. This could be someone that you looked up to at some point. This could be an ex of yours. They could be getting some sort of divorce. They definitely tried to ruin your relationships. They could be having trouble in their own relationships. I feel like people know what they're up to. They didn't look at their own childhood. They might have issues with their uh, their mother or um, a mother figure in their life. So you're not a victim um, or you don't. It's like they've got themselves into this out of greed. They connected with someone who has bad priorities, overly concerned with money, appearances. Someone can't shapeshift around you. Um, you're way stronger than they expected. 
or they might need something from you, or they thought you were going to beg. This could be an energy vampire. I don't know, they didn't believe you, who you are. You're definitely, you, you're an abstract thinker. But you're also very logical too. If you're, if you have trouble being logical, you'll spend the extra time to think something through. Yeah. Because you're, uh, you think, you could be right and left brain both equally. Someone didn't see this about you. There's something that you're creating, or this is you. You could be very abstract and you're connecting with someone who's very linear, and the two of you together are going to pioneer something. Um, or now this person sees, sees an opportunity with you this way. This is a king reverse. They thought they were learning something from someone here. But it's like also there's something very clear about God in the environment. I don't know, this person, the energy is off, they're very greedy. So I feel like there's a masculine energy trying to get advice, maybe about even coming towards you. They're very greedy. They didn't see you as an attribute before. They want to say the right words. There's a stalker around here somewhere. There's a stalker, it could be his Queen of Cups reverse. This person could have a third third party. This could be who they're talking to. This could be a friend, a Queen of Cups reverse. They could be trying to get advice from this Queen of Cups reverse about you. Or this could be um, a family member. They're trying to get advice, but they're trying to get advice from a Queen of Cups reverse. Someone will try to make you do something against your will. So this could be someone who's very manipulative. Someone will gossip about all of your secrets. Someone could be talking about something private. Is your problem because I can't manipulate you? I don't know if somebody, I don't know if someone wants a friend of me. Everything's not a okay. They, they don't love themselves. Yeah, there was something in the beginning about self hatred. Someone's thinking of friend is thinking of you. Yeah, they're thinking of you. You're a sweetheart. Sweetheart, they're thinking of you, but someone's gossiping about you at the same time. It, there's a collaboration falling apart, or someone wants to get near you to block a collaboration. Three of Swords reverse because you're healing from something. Whatever this is, is unjust. Advice from a friend. Something is very unjust here. This person's very materialistic. Seven of Pentacles, a friend is thinking of you. Friendship. Okay, profession. This could be someone that you were friends with that's concerned about who you are connecting with romantically. Swords reverse, they did something unjust to you. Or they're doing something, they're trying to gossip about you. They're gossiping and stalking. They're gossiping and stalking. I don't know if this is an ex of yours talking to their friends, trying to rework something about an 
but it's not just. There's something unfair going on here, and it has to do with your career or your job. You, someone wanted you to be sick and withdraw, quit. Like you were lost in a maze, all alone in the cold. Didn't know which way the exit was. Yeah, someone tried to trap you in a situation without your jacket. It's cold in a, in a maze. You don't know which way the resources are. Someone tried to catch you in a maze. Justice reverse. It was very unfair. Blind. Yeah, it's something about not being able to see. But first, they, they can't see you now. Now someone wants to send a friend to you. Well, this is a friend wants to know what you're doing, but they're stalking and gossiping. Stalking and gossiping. It's about who's coming towards you or who's making this promise to you. I don't know if this is an ex or a friend. They're definitely greed, greed, and they're concerned about your money and whatever they're doing is unjust. Yeah, robbery. There's someone who stole something from you already. Or they feel like they can't take the next thing. What's wrong with these people? It, it could have to do with overloading you. Or they thought they overloaded you, or they feel overloaded. Around your profession? Yeah, like you're lost in some type of, um... You're just trying to survive. You're overloaded. That's what they wanted. Because something originates with you, they didn't want you to be able to originate something friendship something originated with you they could have stolen something but they wanted you just dealing with this disaster with no help no one helping you they, everything's okay with you though you're not lost in a maze you're not in a disaster you're focused on the clock Organized. I feel like they're confused how you got out of the maze, out of the labyrinth. Last thing they did, they left you in a labyrinth in the dead of winter with no jacket and no resources. Wondering which way to go. They feel like there's going to be an announcement coming and they're going to look bad or they're going to fall from grace because of whatever this is. Stop. Stagnation. They're going to be seen as like they're stagnant or something's going to come out because they try to cause stagnation. They feel like it could have to do with a family or an alliance with someone or parenthood or... Someone helping you. They didn't reach their goal. Someone's helping you. They didn't reach their goal. You're not trapped. Someone feels like someone's coming towards you or they're trying to figure out who's coming towards you. Um, seven of Cups or someone does want to come towards you from your past. Readiness reverse. They're not ready for this. They're not prepared. They try to block you from persevering. They feel like they're taking a loss. They feel sick. You're not trapped. You've got this good luck. The magician. They feel like you're just going to appear with this kind of magical reality that you are creating with someone or all on your own vow reverse they shouldn't have taken this vow they feel dissatisfied this, this vow didn't get them anywhere and they're exposed okay so my fan just went on definitely feel like there's a lot of projection here someone could be trying to affect your crown chakra 
you love yourself. Um, desk. Pay attention to your work. Someone is feeling emotional at work. Um, or there could be someone sweet talking to you at work. Oh, there goes the lights. Hey, someone won't help someone. Someone won't help someone at work. Someone feels very upset. Someone won't help someone at work. This could be someone who um, didn't want you to get help at work or at your job. Yeah, this is a profession under the deck. someone's career, they're feeling frustrated at work, they're thinking about what you've got going on. They would try to block you from getting help, they could be very emotional. Someone could be sweet talking someone to try to stop them from helping you. Or they're coming to you. Someone knows you're focused on work. It's about you getting this promise. Or someone is very distracted at work because they know someone's promising you something. There's a Queen of Cups reverse that someone's getting advice from um, or that they're dealing with. There, there's a younger woman here. I feel like there's some sort of disdain in the energy. They're focused on this treasure. What you're getting, what you have. Someone feels like they've got to say something. It's not the words they use. Because you're not, you're not trapped. Tell you about these people, Page of Swords Reverse. What are they doing here? They'll take care. They're trying to stop you from persevering in the environment. Stalkers, slanderers. Um, working against you in the background, in the environment. Um, hesitation, trying to work against you to cause confusion about a decision, advice from a friend, stalker, slanderer, it's something about someone's mental health, stress, state of stress, someone or someone's trying to create stress for someone else. Someone's talking about you. Someone's talking badly about you in the environment to create stress for you, or someone is an anti-sweetheart in the environment. Someone is trying to say you're not a sweetheart, or somebody is gossiping about you, or somebody is creating, trying to create hesitation about you. Um, yeah, they're working overtime in the background. This could be to distract you, drain your energy, but it could be also trying to talk about you. They're anti-you in the environment. They're anti-sweetheart. Page of Swords reversed. This could be someone who is like a stalker energy, slanderer. But I feel like these people appear to be worried about you. Someone is trying to give someone advice about you. Someone could have gone to someone to get advice about you and they are giving someone bad advice. I feel like it's multiple things kind of happening at once. I don't feel like it's affecting you. You could be picking up on the energy because they can't steal whatever this is. You're too protected. This, there's still people collaborating to steal something. Here. This collaboration didn't work. You're not stressed, but there could be efforts. It has to do with your crown chakra. I feel like definitely something to do with your environment for sure. 
um, and who you're connecting with. I feel like there's gossip here. They're confused about who is helping you or who you're connecting with or what exactly it is that you're doing. I don't know if someone's trying to project at you in the near future. You could be focused on work and someone wants you to feel like overwhelmed at with work or at work. And like you can't get any help because your networks are blocked. It's not true. I don't think you need me to tell you that. Um, I feel like this could be them being emotional about you in regards to work. of cups reversed they feel like they've got to work really hard to keep you blocked from someone or to try to ruin a relationship if you're in one so i wouldn't i don't know if these are like whoever this partner is of yours that they want to work against you or get this partner to They want to bribe or persuade a partner to block your ideas, to create a nightmare for you. Two of Cups reverse, hard work ahead. They got to work on this partnership. Marriage. They want to block a marriage. They want to confuse somebody. They want to create an agreement with someone. It's about trapping someone. about confusing somebody but someone's mask is off so I and something is on schedule they're trying to get someone to go along with something take care enemies are going working against you they're trying to get someone focused on materialism To ignore you. Some romances in the air, it's an injustice. Four of Pentacles reverse. Someone's gonna have to let something go. You're, you're getting recognition and reward for your efforts. Doesn't matter what they're trying to do. There's something about your self-esteem recognition, something that you're proud of. You're very calm. You have a lot of inner peace. They know that. Someone is using their words to try to alter a situation. Unclear who this is. I don't know that these people are approaching you directly. If someone is trying to approach you directly, they're having trouble getting near you. If this is someone who's trying to get some sort of advice from a friend about you, they're trying to spin it the wrong way. It's They're doing something unjust. If this is someone from your past trying to come towards you, they could be trying to get advice, but there's greed and this person worked against you. There could be someone here trying to come towards you and someone trying to create hesitation about you. This could be work, but I feel like they're confused about who all is around you and what you're working on or... And I'm not sure if this is a frenemy or if this is an ex. So I think I need to keep clarifying. Um, you 
Yeah, so they were expecting you to be lost in this labyrinth. For you not to emerge. You were supposed to be done for. Karmic feminine energy, though, is being seen for who they are. They are the ones that are not holding this light or the one that is capable of the position or whatever it is that they're trying to do to block here because it's about defamation. Your pathway is clear. Your pathway is clear. You're not in despair. There's something you're building here. You're using your resources, your wits, your energy to co-create with the universe, to receive and allow. This is your birthright. There could be a lot of money at stake here. This could just be about you. You get exactly what you need right when you need it to build something. Well, there's more, more here. Yeah, they feel blocked. They didn't get what they wanted out of a situation. They feel blocked. They tried to take something from you. You still have more. Tell me about what's going on here. Romance is in the air. Someone's gossiping. Someone is getting advice. Someone is talking about you. There's something unjust here. Um, yeah, it has to do with taking you down. Someone is getting advice. Or someone tried to take you down. They didn't get what they thought. A false person is here. They didn't get what they wanted out of something. Or they tried to st stop you from getting something from coming in. This could have to do with a child. Or something you've conceived of. Or something you're birthing. There's another main male involved. This is something to do with what you're gift gifted at. Or someone gifting you something. Seven of Pentacles. Pathway reverse. Advice from a friend. A friend is thinking of you. This friend feels blocked or they want to block you. Unexpected income reverse. They don't want you to get something. Or they thought they were going to get something out of the situation. Marriage reverse. They want to block this marriage. Or their marriage is falling apart. Courtship reverse. Okay, no, they want to stop someone from coming towards you, right? Two of Cups reverse. Marriage. This definitely could have something to do with the child. Or your childhood. Or something that you've conceived of. Or that you're wholesome and they're trying to change the way someone thinks of you. Um... They're worried about this announcement. They feel like they're going to fall from grace because they try to stop you. Yeah, there's something about a message or an announcement. They feel they're going to fall from grace because they try to stop you or they want to stop this announcement. Because you are an honorable person, people are going to see that about you and you're not trapped. That's what they don't want. You're a privileged lady in the upright. That's what they're worried about. And there's some sort of there's working you're working towards this great happiness they weren't ready for this they've been trying to end something for you this karmic has been trying to end something they didn't think something through they didn't get the sudden wealth or they thought they got something from you it, they it's almost like they got the bait they got the bait there's a whole community involved. Something could be happening online. They could be losing money very quickly from whatever they did here. Or they were expecting you to be broke. They feel like you're going to emerge as this magician um, or with this magician. And this is going to be a lot of fun. And they're going to have to see it. And they shouldn't have taken this vow because you, you're manifesting. You don't seem to be concerned about anything that they're doing. Um, this karmic feminine who's a false person. 
You don't seem to be concerned about this false person. They're just dis they feel like they're going to be very dissatisfied with life because you're moving forward, manifesting. Um, yeah, things are changing for you. That's what they're expecting. You you have a lot of inner peace. I don't know if this is like some sort of um, frenemy. This is like stalker, you know, someone attached to an ex of yours. This is a uh, mother figure. This is your mother. This is, I don't know who this is exactly. Uh, still very much focused on you. They want to know who you're connecting to. I don't know if this is like a friend of yours that you don't realize is not a friend, but I don't think so. If you're talking to someone about your new relationships, a feminine energy, I don't think you are, but I would just, you know, you don't want to be paranoid all the time, but Especially if it's a new relationship, just keep it between you and your partner for the time being. I think you're already doing that. There's someone, a stalkery energy, a feminine energy, who's trying to create doubt about you, working against you in the environment. Yeah. I don't know that this person is doing something energetically, although you could be picking up on it energetic. I don't know if they are or they aren't. I feel like there's other people that got involved. They went into agreement. They made a vow together. They all agreed with something. And it had to do with knocking you off your square and taking something from you for sure. Someone could be talking about how to, to stop you. And painting you in a bad light. This definitely involves people from your past or your outer circle, your outer circle, maybe your inner circle your career, your job. There's definitely lie, lies, stalking. Definitely something about work here. I'm not sure who this these people are. Um, privileged lady, you're in the upright in the near future. Someone is real upset at work because of it, or you're focused at work. They thought they were going to get something from something they stole from you, or they went into agreement with something. They didn't get it. They're very upset. They could be really upset that you're this privileged lady. They tried to block all of your help. <laughs> they could have tried to stop every, every avenue. And they also thought they were going to get rich off of something, or they were going to benefit somehow. It's going back to something that this person could have done legally. They could have sent you... They could have possibly sent you something to block your sudden wealth. They're, they're, someone could have tried to block a contract with some type of legal correspondence block something from coming your way or they tried to have you be judged they did something online to block some sort of sudden wealth someone's been trying to have you be judged or do something online to stop your money or something coming flowing to you they can't stand it they're really upset in the near future their feelings are all over the place because you're focused on work um, yeah, change is afoot. 
They can't take it. They could be a group of people here who are all on the same page about something. They, they all know what they did. Or working together to block something or they stole something from you. There's definitely, there could be something um, bureaucratic or there's a paper trail or they try to catch you up with something that has to do with bureaucracy or paperwork or legal issues, red tape, um, petty, something petty, petty, pettiness. Um, online Queen of Cups reverse this person could be younger than you they want your treasure they're looking at your treasure distant horizon something online it's to also block this courtship or block someone from coming towards you Someone is trying to create, or they're worried. There's a stalker that's worried, or they're trying to create some type of hesitation about you in the environment. They could be stalking you online, or this is someone who's trying to stalk your network of people, or someone that's coming towards you, or your friendships, or your your outer circle, or your networks, or your so maybe this is your platform. Um, if you're on one, you know your social media. Um, or your network of people, you know, your team or your, your potential love interest or someone, your friendship group, your neighborhood, your neighbors, there's someone here trying to interfere. What's going on? Family room. This could be very, I mean, this could be happening in your own home. <laughs> If you live with these people, I don't think so. Judication courthouse. Family room. There could be a group of people that all know what they did. This could be happening around your home. This could be happening at your workplace. Like in the office next to you. There's some sort of bureaucracy. There's some type of paperwork. There's some type of legal issues. That they maybe they tried to create for you. There's some type of maybe business transaction, something petty, something trying to cause problems. Trying to have you be judged, trying to create hesitation, trying to create worry, or they're worried. Maybe they don't want something, something's not going through. I know someone's trying to affect. They're trying to hold you back or create worry. They're and they're using doing something bureaucratic, or legal, legal, or they did this in the past, trying to create worry. You're not worried. Um, changes here. Um, two of Cups reversed. They want to block a marriage or a partnership or some type of soul connection. Or they're worried you're working with someone, or this marriage is coming together, you're gonna get married. Thoughts reverse. You're not concerned about them. Yeah, lovers reverse. Expectation, lovers reverse. They're hoping to keep you apart from someone. They're a thief. This marriage could be a business contract. It could be love. You could already be interacting with this person or this has to do with someone, you reconnecting with someone or this is someone in your life already. And it's connected to your great fortune. It's you co-creating with someone. I feel like there's some sort of a perfect match. I feel like there's opposites here. If you're very linear, then they're very abstract. If they're very abstract, then you're very linear. There's some sort of a perfect match here. They're trying to block that they feel like is connected to your great fortune, your birthright, your north node, 
Um, they don't want you coming together with someone, or if you're already with someone, they're trying to create doubt, or they want to be figure out a way they can create doubt. I don't know if someone's trying to come in and distract you. If they're trying to distract this person, or someone's getting advice from the wrong people. I don't know if they know who this person is. It's definitely, uh, there's a karmic feminine energy that is the main, because at first this was coming out as this king of pentacles reverse. There could be a lawyer that's the king of pentacles reverse. They're trying to figure out what you're doing, who you're partnering up with. I don't know, this could be like a frenemy that stole something from you and tried to use legal, the law, the, they try to trap you in a situation, steal something from you, stop you from moving forward. They could be part of a friendship group of yours, or they were. They want to know what you're doing next so they can block it. And they don't want you to have any kind of partnership. They want to figure out how they can block that. Or they're trying to this is like sort of some kind of preemptive guesswork to figure out what they can steal before it happens. <laughs> but I feel like they already tried to do this. They thought it was going to play out differently for them. If they tried to steal something from you in the past, they either lost it all or they're imposters. It's not theirs. I feel like the day and age of people stealing things that don't originate with them is quickly changing. I feel like that's gone on for in every industry since time began. It's an old story. People stealing things that don't belong to them. But I feel like, especially with something that's originated with you that has to do with, because we saw earlier, you're someone that is... You're not just in something for yourself. Even if people don't see you that way, you might not wear spirituality on your sleeve. People might not know. You know, there's no reason to lead with that anyway. That's why these people are under judgment is because you're doing something. What This blueprint you have isn't just for yourself. There's a false person here trying to do something legally or they try to do something legally to get you wrapped up or to, they try to use the legal system to take something from you or to have you be judged, to get you all caught up somehow. Outcome, they're gonna have to let go. If they try to hold on to something maybe legally, um, or it won't matter, they could have stolen something from you and it's emerging some other way, or you just have more of where that came from, and now you're more discerning. Um, outcome, sun wealth reverse. They're trying to steal something from you, um, this false person. It has to do with your work, occupation, to block your work. I don't know if they're trying to use an attorney, a king of pentacles reverse that will do anything, or this is some type of a business partner. There's someone here that is very materialistic and superficial. And for some reason they're trying to use your love life against you. You might know what this is already. Um, you might know who these people are. You might be, because I started out by saying um, this could be something you're, or this is confirmation for you. So I'm just gonna leave it there. Um, I think you know who, who these people are. In some cases, I'm really getting an ex. I don't know 
how it all correlates. I'm getting an X. That could be for someone. There's a, this is an X that's trying to make their way back, and that's the King of Pentacles reverse. There are definitely people here still trying to create some type of confusion, bureaucracy, very focused on a partnership of yours. These are people you already know there's they're thieves, but I just would be, I know I said it was over the reading, that was the end, but and I think I don't need to tell you to use discernment, but there's a reason this is coming up. There could be a Gemini involved. There could be a Capricorn involved. There could be a Scorpio involved. So, and then we've got Mercury and Uranus and Jupiter. Uh, we have the number six, three, and ten. So this would be sixth house, third house, tenth house issues. So there could be something about um, communications here, short travel. Um, this could have to do with what you do every day. Something about what you do every day, where you go, who you talk to, um, your alliances, who works for you, who, who you work with, um, your self-care, your routine, where you go and your routine, who you're talking to, 10th house, your career, your ambition, your discipline. So someone's focused on exactly that what you're doing every day your details and that you've got this stalkery energy here i feel like you're protected but there's a reason why this is coming up and out so i feel like it's just bringing up awareness about it because i feel like you're focused on work which is good and it looks like it's it's going great um so um for some reason this is coming up for you to be aware a distant friend is thinking about you I don't know if someone wants, you know, an old friend's going to pop up and they need information on what you're doing or if this is some um, someone who wants advice and someone's giving them wrong advice about you or someone's they're talking about how to what you're they wonder what you're doing here, what you're doing now, what you're doing, they want to block it or there's they stole something before, they want to make sure to block it still. Or well, there's someone here who feels like they failed at something, they want to come back towards you. I feel like it could be a mixture of both. They could be asking this Queen of Cups reverse for advice, or it's this Queen of Cups reverse that is trying to get the advice. There's about breakthrough and surprises here, thinking outside of the box, luck, and communication. Some sort of surprise, big a big surprise with this magician. Someone's worried about this big surprise. Um, you thinking outside of the box, and they could be shocking. There could be a Scorpio involved. This could have to do um, with, you know, stock market as well, other people's money, transformation, things that are hidden, you transforming behind the scenes, um, obsession, you know, definitely your career, a more obsession here. Um, Gemini, there could be... Um, Something about siblings, twins, twin flames, connections, soul connections, um, thought, rapid communication, um, thinking, um, not not landing on a decision, overthinking, um, tricks, tr tricks, trick, tricky communication other people's money, tricky communication, something to do with your ambition. Someone could be born on October 3rd, October 6th, or in the month of October, March 10th, March 6th, June 3rd, June 10th, or those could be significant dates. Um, 
Yeah. It's going to be have to do with a transit. Mercury in the 10th house, Mercury in the 3rd house, Mercury in the 6th house. Jupiter in the 10th house, Jupiter in the 3rd house, Jupiter in the 6th house. Uranus in the 10th house, Uranus in the 3rd house, Uranus in the 6th house. Yeah. This is the, like, yeah, this could be some sort of destructive energy in your 10th house. Uranus. Uranus moves, moves, your Uranus is in Taurus. Uh, and it moves out of Taurus, I feel like, in 2026. Not sure where Jupiter is at the moment. And Mercury travels really quickly. So there's definitely something about Gemini here. Um, wow. Definitely something about Uranus for sure. Um, so maybe look look and see where Uranus is in your chart. And I feel like with Jupiter here, there's some big, big lucky event or something like that. And that's what they're focused on. Um, and you, but you're, you're very diligent though. Uh, and something's hidden. They can't see it. There could be a Scorpio working against you in the background. Uh, you could be Scorpio. There could be a Sagittarius. There could be an Aquarius. All right, we'll leave it there for now. If you resonate, I hope that it helps. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.